Fertilization in Flowering Plants. In this module, you will learn about the process of fertilization in flowering plants. Fertilization in flowering plants is defined as the fusion of a pollen grain with an ovule to form a diploid zygote which later develops into an embryo. It may be interesting to learn that the fertilization in plants is known as double fertilization as two fusions occur in the embryo sac instead of one. These fusions are called syngamy and triple fusion. The process of fertilization begins with the compatible pollination. Pollen grains from different plants gather on the stigma of the pistil, but the compatible pollen grains that can germinate produce a pollen tube. On reaching the stigma, the pollen grain containing two nuclei germinates to produce the pollen tube. The pollen tube grows down into the soil, deriving nutrition from it. The generated nucleus and the vegetative nucleus of the pollen grain move to the lower end of the pollen tube. Here the generated nucleus divides mitotically into two male gametes or spans. The vegetative or tube nucleus of pollen grain is responsible for the growth of pollen tube. The vegetative nucleus degenerates after reaching the ovule. The pollen tube at this stage with the vegetative nucleus and two male gametes grows down into the ovary. The entry of the pollen tube into the ovule through the mycopyle, chalaza or integuments is known as porogamy, chalazogamy and mesogamy respectively. Porogamy is the most common out of these. After the pollen tube enters the ovule, it discharges the two sperms it carries into the synergids of the embryo sac. This causes the synergid cells to rupture, thus leading to the fusion of a sperm cell with an egg cell or an oospher. Due to this fusion, a diploid zygote is formed, which gives rise to an embryo. This process is known as generative fertilization or syngamy. Note that out of the two sperms released in the embryo sac, one undergoes generative fertilization, whereas the other free sperm cell fertilizes the two polar nuclei of the central cell. In this case, as fusion of three haploid nuclei takes place, the process is called triple fusion. The triple fusion results into the formation of endosperm. After the double fertilization, the ovary starts to swell and develops into a fruit with seeds. In this module, you learn that fertilization in flowering plants is the process of fusion of the male and the female gamete. Fertilization in plants is known as double fertilization as two fusions occur, syngamy and triple fusion. The compatible pollen grains produce a pollen tube. After reaching the ovary, the pollen tube enters the ovule via micropyle, chalaza, and integuments. After entering the ovule, the pollen tube enters the synergist and ruptures it. The pollen tube releases two sperm cells in the synergist. One of the sperm cells fuses with the egg cell to form a diploid zygote. This process of fertilization is known as syngamy. Another sperm cell moves towards the central cell and fertilizes with two polar nuclei. This process of fertilization is known as the triple fusion.